As the arson investigation grows in the case of Taylor Partain, the volunteer firefighter accused of starting two fires, an Abilene man is wondering if that fire that burned his 100-year-old family home last year was also arson. K-Texas reporter Roger Mata spoke with the landowner. Roger, what do you have to say? Braid, Rob Haley said he always believed his rural home in Jones County was lost in a fire that was started by an arsonist. Please send someone out as soon as you can. And she had to slow me down. I was so excited. Rob Haley remembers the 911 call as if it were yesterday. This is where his home stood 349 days ago. It was lost in a grass fire on April 17th of last year. I think there's no doubt whatsoever it was arson. That, would, that could not have been a an accident. Investigators are looking into the cause of fires in this area and what connection they might have to the case of Taylor Partain, a Hamby volunteer firefighter accused of setting fires throughout the area. Haley recalls the fire vividly. My dad's Bible right by my bedside was burnt and then here was a brand new pair of boots that my son had bought for me. I had some uh, cast iron skillets on the stove. One of them, the handle was bent 90 degrees down. That's how hot it was. That that was a stove. Around the home, signs of old school living. It was somewhat of a time capsule lost to a grass fire. Looking at it now, what's the number one thing you think of? The fact that nobody was hurt. As to a possible arson suspect? I hope justice is meted out to you, and I also hope that God forgives you. Because in my heart, yes, I, I as a Christian, I have to forgive him too, and, and I will. As you saw, Haley has a sign posted at the entrance of his property offering a $2,000 reward for information leading to the arrest and conviction of an arsonist. He told us he still fully trusts his Hamby volunteer firefighters. Thanks, Roger. Here are some facts on the investigation of Taylor Partain, the suspect arrested in connection with fires in Jones County. He was detained by authorities on March 20th this year in connection with a fire at the Hamby United Methodist Church. Last week, investigators linked him to a May 2011 fire on a county road 313 and are looking into his possible involvement into other fires around that time of last year. Uh, for these, Partain faces at least two counts of arson.